All right, tonight we are going to take a look at the FCM 36 Pack 40 Tank Destroyer. This little bugger is 50% off this weekend during Vive la France weekend. Um, and uh, so long live the French and their awesome little tank destroyer. This thing is a blast. Uh, it's a premium tank, so you earn extra money and extra experience. Uh, you can run some of your tank destroyer crews, though it doesn't match up completely with all of the French tank destroyers. It does match up with some of them. But you can still use it to train the crew members that will fit in here. So uh, it's a good way to get a little step up for your crew members. It's also extremely cheap. I think it's going to be about, <coughs> I want to say, like 2 or $3. Um, it's not a very expensive tank. So, uh, And for the amount of fun that you get, you really do get a lot of fun with this tank. Now, the downsides. It's really slow, and it has no armor. But the upsides, it has decent camo. It has an amazing gun, basically a Tier 5 gun. Well, Tier 4, but it can damage Tier 5 tanks fairly easily. Um, so you kind of have to balance. You know, just like anything with the premium tanks, it's a balancing act. Some good things are good about it. Some things are bad. This is the consummate base camper. Um, you're not ever going to get very far from cam from base, but you need to work your way into positions where you can do damage. So uh, you'll see me do that tonight, but oftentimes you do end up kind of near the base or not too far from it. So um, you will be called a camper sometimes when you run this tank. Deal with it. <laughs> you know, just put up with it and move on. Uh, this thing is slower than a TOG. So... Um, it's got 180 hit points, which is almost nothing. You're pretty much one or two shotable once you're spotted. Um, it's got 91 horsepower, which would explain why 24 kilometers per hour is the top speed limit. I don't think I've ever seen 24 kilometers an hour in this tank. I mean, realistically, you run between 12 and 13 kilometers an hour on flat ground. Okay, traverse speed, 37. Um, once again, no hull armor. 40 front, 40 back, 20 side. There's not a lot of armor on this thing. It's it's very soft, but it's a tank destroyer. It's supposed to be. Really good view range for its tier. At tier 3, 400 view range plus the binox, you're looking at, um, let's see, 440 would be 10%. So, yeah, almost 500 view range with the binoculars. So if you're sitting still, you have a very long view range with this tank. It's nice. Um, plus you get the camo net, you know. So I'm using camouflage paint, camo crew, camo net. And all those things together equal a tank that's pretty hard to see, um, but also is pretty decent as far as the gun goes. So let's go ahead and run this tank. Uh, let's look at the service record real quick first, though. Um, oh, yeah. And I would recommend running Camo Net and Binox. First of all, they're cheap, and you can take them off and use them on other tank destroyers like the SU-76 or any of your other ones. Um, but then I also use the gun rammer to help it load faster. Um and as far as perks, you know, obviously six senses is really important. And then these uh, camouflage perks are very important. So now my six sense is not operational yet because it's only at 40%. Let's go ahead and run a battle. Oh, wait. Urk! Service record. My gosh. You can tell it's been a while since I've done a full review. <coughs> All right. Statistics. I've had 104 battles with the FCM 36 Pack 40. I've got a 63% win rate. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty wicked. Maximum destroyed battle, seven. Um, I average about one and a half vehicles destroyed per battle. It's okay. Um, it's got a good damage ratio. I mean, this is a great tank. It really is a fun little tank. And for three or four bucks, it's worth it. So let's go ahead and run it. C'est parti. C'est parti. This is definitely a sniper situation, this map. And I'll probably get called a camper. But once again, look how fast I'm moving. Oh, there's 12, 11, oh, 13, 17, 18. Whoa, 22. <laughs> That's it, man. That's as fast as this thing will ever go. 24, there we go. Make a turn, it all bleeds away. Back down to 12. <laughs> 10, 8. <laughs> anyway. Yeah, got that nice bush in front of us back up there, so that'll <coughs> help keep us hidden. 
But of course we have the up the middle sneak. And I can't hit him because there's a rock in the way. I'm going to try to shift here a little bit. And the medium too says, Idiots! Idiots! And he's not moving, Bob Cooper. He's calling everyone idiots and sitting at base. Okay, so the cruiser two. Whoop. The shot's coming in. I'm going to back out. Better play it safe than sorry. Oh, I must be spotted, man. He won't be able to hit me, though. I'm too far away. Yeah, I mean, look at the look at the damage that that gun does at tier three. Two hits on the medium two. This guy's gonna be wishing and crying for mama. <laughs> Come on, Chiha! Wow, just gonna rip him to shreds, huh? It's cruiser two. He's going bye bye. Yep. And D2. <laughs> Pardonnez-moi, s'il vous plaît. Okay. <laughs> yeah, the, the view range, once again, is just ridiculous on this tank. So when you're sitting still, now of course I'm moving, but when you're still... Oh, I shouldn't have moved. Man, all these guys are still coming. Boy, they all went over on this side. That's surprising. Well, our light tank is falling back. And so is the Vespa. Come on, pop out. Come on, a little more. Well, I have to try to hit him. I couldn't. Shoot. There we go. Oh! This does tend to pitch things around a little bit. Seeing if I would have stayed up where I was. Yeah. <coughs> Gosh dang it. Okay, well these guys are gonna come up the mid. I'll I'll finish them off. I'm gonna move it over here. Yep. Nice. <laughs> this guy's gonna move my way. Come on. Come on. A little further. Oh, he went the other way. Dang it. Instead of backing off, he got a he got aggressive. I was hoping he'd back off. Oh, come on. Rats. It's not gonna be till here that I can see him. <laughs> what was that? <coughs> yeah, our T2 light's going to get him. <laughs> Good game. <laughs> yeah, look at that. So, <laughs> second highest score, of course, with three kills, most on the team. And uh, nine shots fired, six. This tank is so awesome. 12,000 experience, or 1,200 experience. That should be the times two, though. Or maybe times three. Let's see what the actual 407, yeah. All right, let's take it for one more battle. And just so you're aware, uh, this does this tank does see tier five. So uh, it does not get the preferal ma preferential matchmaking that a lot of the light tanks get, or a lot of the tier three, or premium tanks in general get. Um, you will be seeing tiers four and five. So be prepared for that. Uh, you're not quite effective in tier five though you can be i mean it's not bad it just you don't have much health really 140 is one shotable by a lot of tanks at tier five so be prepared for those kind of battles but most of the time you're not in tier five so but just keep that in mind because you will be there occasionally let's go do another battle all right so here we have a mostly tier three four battle um yeah this is not the greatest map for this tank for sure there's not 
a ton of great positions for this. It depends on the layout. Uh, but because this is an encounter battle, it makes it harder because there's not you're not defending a base necessarily. So I'm going to have to try to get out into the field before anybody gets there. But eh, right away, it's too late. Now, thankfully, there is no artillery. Um, they do have FCM on their team. And a very aggressive T-28. <laughs> he came right over the ridge into our territory and is attempting to wreak havoc. But I hated the T-28, man. That was a rough tank to play. I think this T-40 shiny onion has a good idea here. I'm going to get up on this ridge line over here. I don't necessarily like where he went with it, but uh oh, crap. Out in the open. This is really bad. He doesn't see me, though, so... He will now, though. Watch me leave him with, like, 1% health. Oh, no. Thankfully, the C40 hit him, so... Crapsicles. They're already capping. This is so bad. Let's see, 28... Uh, we are going to lose. Oh, I can't, I'm not going to be able to get there fast enough to do anything about it. M3 Lee. Oh my gosh. Now well, the Chihi's a goner, but... i got to clear these guys out fast. Oops, I missed. Okay, goodbye. Hopefully these meads are strong enough to stop that cap. Oh, huh, I just a little Stewart. Oh my gosh. Hit him, guys. <laughs> The responses. <laughs> there we go. So their FCM 50T is still... Really? Come on, man. <laughs> oh, there he is. Got him. Yeah, I got a kill, finally. <laughs> Brûlé. So we have the T-28 that was base camping. And I have no idea where that AMX is. We have not seen him yet. But you can see, even on Tier 4, this tank does fine. Uh, the slowness is a little bit of a... Can be a little bit of a problem, but... Whoops. Totally whiffed that one. But this guy... Yeah. T-28 can... I think that 50 million can clear the buildings. There we go. Well, this guy's got a derpy gun. He can... <laughs> I'm going to back up, though. No point in dying when we're so close to the end here. Ah! <laughs> what did he say? <laughs> oh, he killed my driver and my commander. Oh, my gosh. He's going to kill the Stug. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Okay, got your butt to me. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, load. Boom. Oh. <laughs> I probably should have loaded HE. Right, we won. Good game. All right, so I did okay. Tier 4, not bad. Um, Yeah, 10,000 credits, not bad earned. Not great, but, you know, I mean, it's a tank destroyer. I'm tier 3. <laughs> uh, yeah, so I think it's worthwhile. It's, like I said, it's not... The greatest tank destroyer ever, but it's fun. And it really oftentimes, obviously, I get a lot of wins with this tank. It's, you know, that's 60, 63 wins out of 100. That's pretty good. So, uh, but you have to be patient. That's the biggest trick. It's slow. So, and no armor. So, you just have to play it like a real true tank destroyer. 
So anyway, have a great night, guys, and uh, I hope you enjoyed this review. Uh, please be sure to subscribe and keep on tanking. Bonjour. Thank you.